Action. Can I get your drink? Vodka. Your vodka, go right. Water would be fantastic. Just a glass of water. I really don't drink. Oh. I, uh... You know, just at Edward's place, you were like... You know. I was not drunk. At all. I hope you don't think that, because I totally... No, nah, I just mean that uh, we're drinking at Edward, so I didn't think the no drinking rule was like a hard and fast rule or anything. Is this a problem for you? Is it like important to you that I drink? No. I mean, I asked for a glass of water and you're turning it into some major moral crisis here. No, nah, I mean, it's just, uh, you said we need water. It doesn't seem very... Does it seem what? Like you could get me drunk on water? I was just... No, I... I was just going to say that water doesn't seem very festive. It just seems so plain. I, I know everybody drinks it now out of bottles and everything, but to me it always just seems so plain. Plain is good. Plain is strong. Water is the strength of the earth. I don't find that plain. I find that inspiring. I know. I know. Let me, let me get you a glass of water. Wait a minute. I'm sorry. I'm sorry I'm a little reactive. You're right. I mean, I said I'd come over here for a drink, and water, it's just not nice or something. I know you're trying to be real nice, and I'd love a glass of vodka. I had a real ridiculous day. Vodka's actually an excellent idea. Maybe put some ice in it. Okay. So, um, how's your friend, the Nazi priestess? Oh, she's, you know, she's really not that bad. Oh, I know. I totally know. Those things I said the other night, my bad. My total bad. Well, it's okay. You didn't know. No, but your friend did. And he just let me keep going. It's just a little rude to let me go on like that. I was like, ouch, got a problem with a sack with old wife, maybe? No, oh, it's not like that. They're really tight. They've been together for... Oh, what do I know? Fourteen. Fourteen years, and they're adopting this baby. They're great. Yeah, what do I know? Oh, wow. Hmm. Uh, it was just tense that night about other stuff. Look, don't treat me like I'm stupid. I think I know the difference between tension and hostility, so it's not like I'm stupid. I didn't say that. Well, you're acting kind of... No. Nah. No. I, I didn't know. Because a lot of people treat me certain way because I look like a flake or something and that is just I mean I don't want to sound like a hideous feminist but I will not be treated like a stupid person I want to be clear on that no I just I, I wouldn't have asked you to come over if I thought that you were stupid well good because I really respect what you were saying it's just, I am, I mean, your friend has a lot of angry energy, which I like. I mean, I'm not saying it's a bad thing if he's married to a screaming woman with raving highlighters. She's really nice. What do I know? I'm just saying, I don't judge him if he's hostile about it. I'm going to go get myself a drink. Can I refresh that for you? You know what? I'm just going to get the bottle. You want a piece of cheese? Oh, God, no. I'm so full on a diet. Food is, like, disgusting to me. That's weird. I mean... The things that people put in their mouths nowadays is totally just like eating death. That's how bad our food is for us. Do you not know this? They proved, somebody proved, that eating is killing people. 
and that if you eat like hardly anything, just like lettuce and maybe a few vegetables every day, that you could live to be like 150 years old. This is true. I read about it in the New York Times. Eating. It's terrible for you. Don't do it. Yeah, that's uh, because everything I've read says, you know, that food is life-sustaining. Except didn't you suspect that it was probably bad for you? All those people all over America getting fat, just like buying food from grocery stores or going to those restaurants where they give you those portions, and everything has chemicals in it, or who knows what? Who knows what they put in our food anymore? Uh, who, uh, knew? Or, yeah, who knew? Well, I know it sounds weird, but... You know what? Forget it. I'm sorry. This is... I should go. No, why? I don't feel right. This just doesn't feel right. Please, I really like you. I... I mean it. I do. You just want to sleep with me. No, I... It's not what I mean. You don't want to sleep with me? That's not what I said. It's... See, this just happens all the time. Just everybody just wants to sleep with me. Every guy I meet... And it's just, I don't know what to do about it, because I'm like a very sensitive person. I didn't just invite you over here for sex, if that's what you think. It is what I no, think. No, it's is. not. Oh, please. I, I really like you. I mean it. I think you're really interesting. I do. It's just, everybody falls in love with me all the time. So many guys are obsessed, and I... I'm from Ohio. It's different there. I feel very overwhelmed. I feel very out of control here. Would you like a glass of water? <sighs> Maybe some vodka. I don't know. I'm kind of tense. Here, it's okay. Have a seat. It's just been a very confusing day. What happened? I don't want to talk about it. Come on. I'm interested. Would you like to kiss me? question. You just seem like a really nice person. I think I'd really like it if you'd kiss me, if you're interested. Well, I mean, you were talking about men paying too much sexual interest in you, and now... This. Do you think I'm a freak or something? No. Because I've been freaking out over here? No. I know. I know. I did just say that. But I think I'd really like it if you would kiss me, if you would like. No, but, you know what, forget about it. No, no, it's okay, really. How's that? It's nice.